Hello everybody, Mark Patterson, NCKFA. I've been promising you all year I'm going to take you along and catch some big fish. Well, next weekend is the plan. What I'm going to do is kind of make a series of my quest for Cobia. Uh, the series was supposed to start last weekend, but coming off the beach at Fort Fisher, I blew the brake line out on the front right tire of my truck. Had a little trouble stopping. Got to learn how the emergency work brake works and was rescued by a nice gentleman named Steve and some other NCKFA members kind of helped me out and sidebar, hook as my wife calls, that's a great thing about the NCKFA and I'm sure other clubs too. You meet so many great people and a big shout out to Steve from down there who knew me from my videos ironically enough at Carolina Beach and kind of got me to the service station. Big shout out to Mike Lowe who gave me a ride back to uh, pick up my truck the uh, two days later. So the weekend was completely lost, but the good news is I didn't hit anybody. I didn't get hit, and they're catching the cobia. They called a couple this weekend. I was uh, lucky enough, I guess, to ride the bike that I commandeered, thanks to Mr. Stone from down at the beach for loaning me a bike to the pier and watch them catch about a 40 or 42 pound cobia. So I know they're out there. This weekend I'm going to take you along. Here's my plan right now. Uh, I'm going to use my stand up paddle. Uh, oh, try to break my life. My accent cannon stand up paddle. Uh, stand up, look around, look for sea turtles, look to see if I see them cruising. That's my plan because I'm not the tallest guy so I certainly can't see them if I'm sitting seated in the kayak really well. So stand up, look for sea turtles. If I see the turtles, which I saw several on the pier when I was watching them catch that cobia, I'm going to be throwing a uh, boat up lure in a bright orange, black combination. Obviously I'll add a trailer to it, but I'm not going to do that now because it'll dry up and stink up my kitchen. Also got this hot pink, which I love. So I'll be throwing that to them if they don't want the orange. Throwing those. Like I say, big shout out to boat up lures for hooking me up with some cool lures that hopefully you'll get them. They were catching them on the pier uh, on small live bluefish. So in addition to the boat up lures that I'll have out there, I'm also going to be uh, trolling around. I'm making up my rigs right now, trolling around some live bluefish back there on a rig rig float back there, the same float I use for king mackerel. So hopefully while I'm looking, uh, they might pick up the one behind me. They were catching kings too. So. Stay tuned. I'm going to do a little whole series here on how it actually works uh, from loading the kayak, taking it out on the beach, driving down. Hopefully no car incidents. Hopefully we'll have good wind. If we don't have good wind, watch me go red fishing. So anyway, wish me luck. Copia season's here. We'll see how it goes. Follow me on Instagram. I'm going to be doing the post for NCKFA OIC. So hopefully you'll see some pictures of uh, some cobia coming into the boat. Oh, shout out to Thomas at Southern Outdoors Fishing. He's going to be out there doing some filming too. He's been helping out a lot. And uh, hopefully we'll have some good video and some good cobia. If you got any tips, please email me, mark at nckfa.com, or post them up on the website. Thanks so much.